What is up, YouTube? Today is going to be a jack of all trades aura, aura, whatever you want to call it. It's an aura. It's actually a buffer, but in RuneScape they decided to call it auras. Auras. And, um, yeah, I'm going to do a little review on it. Jack of trades. It's a pretty awesome one. I actually found out about it through Rune Shark and, uh, what it actually does. And I thought I'd make a little review on it, what I think on it, and, uh, yeah. So let's get straight to business. Alright, so we're going to activate it. It can be only activated once every 24 hours. So boom, there we go. We're going to bring this down a little bit. Hold on. Alright, so now we got it. Now we're all powered up. We got our aura on. Let's do all the jack of trades. Now as you can see on inventory, I have a couple different items. You're going to equip your Zami Spear if you have one. It's shared XP, so there you go. There's three. Three skills are down. You have to get 10 skills in 24 hours, I believe. And uh, that's more than enough time. Alright, so there's three, there's four, there's prayer right there. We're gonna shoot one of these guys. There's five. Oh, that's five. You can see. Yeah, no, that's six. Six out of the ten necessary. Oh, health, that's right. Alright, so that guy's dead. You can pickpocket one if you really want. There you go. There's seven or eight. I don't know what I'm on now. Shit. Anyways. Alright, so what are we on? Alright, we got 7 out of 10. Alright, so wood cutting is 8. Alright, we can fletch this one. And it doesn't really matter. What do you want to fletch it into? Get one more. Come on, there you go. Oh, fuck, it didn't fletch. Uh -huh. Alright, so fire making. And then fletching. Then you're done. You've done Jack of Trades. That's all you had to do. You had 24 hours to do that, but you really only need a couple minutes. Boom, you have 10 out of 10. You're going to take this, you're going to rub it, and you're going to go all the way to Troll Invasion. Game's necklace. And you only can do this once every 24 hours, so it's pretty good just to like do it around noon. And then skip a day every once in a while. And then, uh, so you can choose what time you want to start doing it around. Um... It's also best to do it every day. Uh, then you remove the aura. Talk to this guy, and he'll give you a XP book. I'm going for 99 Slayer, so we're gonna use it on Slayer. You can use it on any skill, and it gives I think around the same, almost same XP it gives every time. So you can use it on any skill. Uh, Person, I'm gonna use it on Slayer just to speed up my Slayer XP because 99, I need it. And uh, boom, we got 8,563 XP. So that's not bad, guys, for what, a couple minutes? This video is only a couple minutes long, so I showed you guys everything. This is all in real life speed, uh, no flashy or anything. You guys can use different items if you want. I know some of these are pricey uh, for some of you guys, but it's really simple, guys. Um, yeah, you guys really aren't, you know, it's not too expensive to do this. And uh, of course, you can replace it with different items. You just have to do 10 skills in 10 in 24 hours, and you can go claim your. Oh shit, my phone! You can go claim your prize. <laughs> All right, guys, that's uh, my review. I give this item a 10 out of 10 because it's so fucking awesome. And uh, you can use this in rune crafting. Um, they were saying in the video that I watched that they recommend this for people that are gonna go out for um, max cape. Uh, it totally makes sense to me because that little extra boost every day, it adds up real quick because it's not even that little of a boost, it's a pretty big boost. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please comment, rate, subscribe, and later.